Hello, I'm Martin Moroni. I'm the driving force behind Joyful Pop-Up Weddings in Sydney. Now you'll hear those words being bandied around by a few people, pop-up weddings. Let me tell you what's in a pop-up wedding the way that we provide them. Well, I'll tell you first why we started this. I'm a very experienced married celebrant. In fact, I like to think that I'm one of the top married celebrants. And I've noticed that couples spend a huge amount of money on their wedding days. Well, that's all very well, but Emory University in Atlanta, Georgia last year published a research paper where they interviewed 3,000 people about the outcomes of their marriages. And they found that in America, this is $20,000. If you spend more than $20,000 on your wedding day, you're three and a half times more likely to get divorced. <gasps> well, now let's compare that to Australia. Bride to Be magazine, in their latest survey on uh, bridal costs and you know, wedding surveys, they found that the average spend on an Australian wedding nowadays is $64,500. That's an insane amount of money. Well, it's fine if you've got the money, but what happens if you haven't got the money and you just got sucked into it? Well, I think that a lot of brides and grooms get sucked into that kind of expenditure because when they start, they don't really know what they're doing. So what happens? They go to a venue. Well, it's $150 per guest. <gasps> well, just sign here. OK, um, we need a photographer. Well, a photography package, standard photography package, by the way, nowadays is $4,950. Just sign here. Uh, we need some flowers. Um, uh, well, that's $1,200 and so on and so forth. Now, if you try and do it on your own and you say, OK, we're just going to do this, we're going to budget this, we're going to, put, we're going to have something in a park. Well, you have to go and rent the park space. Um, if you go to Balmoral Oval, it's $880. Um, an average park is $450, $500. Oh, by the way, you're going to need some chairs. Uh, that's another, from a, you know, a hire company, that's another $550. It all runs away with itself. So, I put together a pack. What can I do for brides and grooms that make it a lot easier? Well, how can we give them a smooth ride so they have a fantastic, classy day without spending an extraordinary amount of money? Hence, pop-up weddings. So, what's in a pop-up wedding? Well, we have three venues. We've got Loxley on Bellbird Hill. We've got uh, the Gardens at Peakhurst and Baronia House in Mosman. They're all venues that do the $64,500 weddings at the weekends. Pop-up weddings happen on a Friday or during, you can have any day during the week. If you're within about three months of your marriage and you want to book, if, the venue, if those venues aren't booked at that stage, they'll sometimes take pop-up weddings at the weekends. But the standard offering is pop-up weddings on a Friday. All right, so you turn up with your 40 guests, you can have a lot more than that. You can have up to 120 guests for, for an additional charge. The standard package is for 40 guests. You turn up with your 40 guests. You don't necessarily turn up with the guests. It's up to you. We'll work out how you do it. You'll, um, very often the bride and groom arrive separately, but you're greeted, your guests are greeted by a professional master of ceremonies. We manage the event from the time you turn up to the time that you leave. It's done professionally. It makes a big difference. The marriage ceremony itself, now we pride ourselves on the kind of marriage ceremonies that we deliver. Your marriage ceremony should be the jewel in the crown of your wedding day. So, uh, you have a 25 minute marriage ceremony. If you go shorter than 20 minutes, about 20 minutes, it doesn't feel like a marriage ceremony. If you go much longer than 25, people get worried about getting to the drinks. Sad but true. At the end of the marriage ceremony, uh, we have a joyful celebration. We've got uh, drinks and canopies. Now, all of these uh, venues have got professional chefs, professional wait staff, and their own commercial kitchens. So you get restaurant quality canopies delivered by professionals. Uh, there's a celebration. We have a staff photographer who takes about 150 uh, shots of, of, of the whole thing, of you arriving, what happens during the ceremony, uh, family photos, group shots, and all the rest of it. That goes on for about 40 to 50 minutes. Now, at the end of that, we can't just send you away saying, well, this is it, see you later. So we have a completion ceremony. So we get you all together, and then usually it's a wine ceremony. We have it. It's about 
the family is coming together. By that time, everybody's in a terrific mood. Um, you all, uh, we end up with this wine ceremony, you all toast each other, and then off you go. Well, where do you go to? Well, some couples say, look, we'd like to stay at the venue, and we want to have a high tea afterwards, or we want to have a cocktail party. That's perfectly possible. You can do that with the venue, uh, at additional charge, of course. Um, some people just go home. Uh, because that's it. They say, we've had a great day. Um, some people go off and party somewhere else. If you go somewhere else, don't mention the W word. If you say wedding, the price goes up. I mean, it's actually true. Uh, Choice magazine did a survey where they compared birthday parties and, uh, and wedding parties, exactly the same product. And they went around and shopped around a few venues and it was always a lot more expensive for the wedding. Outrageous, but there you go. So a pop-up wedding is a way of containing all of this expenditure so that you have a very classy marriage ceremony in a very classy venue delivered by experts in a way that it wouldn't normally be available to you. Now, if all of this interests and excites you, it certainly excites us because we're surrounded, I'm surrounded by a group of professionals who are at the top of their game and who are interested in delivering a really high class product. So if this interests you, give me a call, we'll get together, I'll show you around the venues and we'll go from there. So pick up the phone, give me a call and we'll take it from there. Thank you.